Hey guys, this is Pratik. Uh, thanks for coming back to my channel and watching my video. So, uh, once again, Happy New Year. And uh, what I'm going to tell you today is uh, going to be a lifesaver for you as it is uh, for me. So, um, let me tell you today is uh, 2nd December 3.40. Okay, so it's 4 a.m. in the morning. Uh, so as usual uh, for the you know, for many people you know uh, uh, when I was uh, so um, before I go ahead uh, before I go to the main story what I uh, main uh, content that I wanted to share with you uh, let me uh, let me share that uh, so it's it's a month ago that um, I buy a, buy I bought a new DSLR okay. Uh, so it's an entry level DSLR Nikon D3400, uh, one of the best and uh, cheapest uh, DSLR you can buy in the market. So uh, once I bought it, uh, sorry for this noise, my fridge is keeps on annoying me at, uh, um, okay, sorry. Um, so I bought a new I bought this new DSLR and you know uh, uh, this is my this is not my first camera uh, I had one Nikon Coolpix but uh, after that uh, this is the first DSLR camera I bought uh, from uh, my hard earned money so I was so excited I uh, I'm, I'm till now I'm very very much excited and I love my camera okay um, so uh, upon buying this uh, camera I came across uh, not a problem uh, but something that you would look for so uh, is a live view now okay so there is a live view option at the back side of the camera uh, right uh, so using which there is a monitor LCD monitor using which you can live view but what ha what if you are uh, you are blogging or uh, you want to uh, shoot yourself okay so at that particular time it is it is really annoying like uh, you don't know how you were uh, presenting yourself in front of the camera so maybe you you shoot yourself you shoot the whole story your story was great but just because you, you did not uh, you was not able to uh, portrait yourself properly or the product or uh, something the content that you want to portrait in front of the camera was not uh, displayed properly it it really annoys you right so it's just like uh, taking a selfie uh, okay uh, so what I can tell you is, uh, so for last couple of days I was uh, looking for a solution, like a very easy solution. The first thing that come, comes in your mind is uh, external camera, external, sorry, not external camera, uh, external monitor, right? Okay, so uh, to be very honest, I'm a middle class, I'm, I'm from a middle class family and uh, I have a limited income. I spend uh, somewhere around 38,000 to buy this camera now again I cannot spend uh, something bigger uh, something bigger uh, to buy an external monitor so I was looking for an alternate so when I was looking for an alternate many things came across uh, that DSLR dashboard, death ring, lots of things okay but somehow things were not working out for me okay so um, when I say some of the things are things were not working so in last uh, couple of days I have at least tried 15 to 20 apps um, available in the market uh, through using App Store through using Google Store uh, Google Play Store okay um, I was uh, hovering around the YouTube and uh, Google, okay. so nothing was really working out for me. Okay, 
when I say that it is it is nothing really working out for me. It is it is like how I wanted it and what I was getting was totally different. Okay, so suddenly, uh, suddenly today, uh, today just uh, an hour ago, uh, I came across uh, I came across the name of this application uh, at the first. Uh, place uh, at, at the first instance only but I did not try it because uh, in play store it is uh, something like you have to pay something okay okay and uh, I was trying to do something out of free of cost I okay so I was checking that uh, you can uh, you can connect your mobile you can connect your lab, uh, laptop but nothing was working but uh, uh, so uh, just uh, an hour ago what I did is I turned on my laptop. I searched for this app. Q its name Q D S L R dashboard. Uh, Q D S L R dashboard. I will uh, okay. You can say uh, okay. So after after which um, I tried to find it out over the internet and I found this app for my laptop. Uh, precisely for my Mac. Okay, because you know uh, the apps that are available in the market, uh, all the apps which are uh, which works with Windows will not work with uh, Mac. Okay, so I wanted a Mac version, so I started looking for it suddenly, and uh, I found one same app, QDS DSLR, and I installed it, and I uh, started looking myself trust me guys right now I'm uh, shooting myself using my Nikon DSLR and uh, there is an external monitor that I'm using is in my laptop I will show you so if you see see this is what I'm using okay so I know on the on site that okay how am I representing myself and to be very honest it's very easy uh, for a user like Nikon D3400 where Bluetooth uh, facility is not available so and I'm a Bluetooth sorry not Bluetooth the uh, Wi-Fi is not there so there are many apps which are not compatible okay which will not work according to your requirement so I just uh, plugged into it it was pretty simple process I just installed it okay uh, and basically this application is nothing that you need to install you just need to keep it on your system you open it and I did I just connected my uh, Nikon using an USB cable okay uh, I connected my Nikon and my Mac using a USB cable and uh, I can see myself in front of the camera, in front of my Nikon DSLR and the results are in front of you. Okay. I hope you like this video and uh, I truly recommend this particular app uh, um, for the bloggers who use, who are, who wanted to use a Nikon. Um, I will give my feedback, I will give my, I will do a separate video on uh, how to use it using your mobile. I know there are others but I will share my experience with it. How is it acting um, when I am connecting or I am using on my. So now I have the, I will say that as I am right now I am using uh, my uh, laptop. So I am, I have got the confidence to use it on my mobile also. So. Uh, when I'm outside and I cannot carry my laptop, I will try my mobile. So I'm, I think I will make an investment on QDSLR app through uh, Google Play Store and uh, I'm gonna go with it. Thanks guys. Uh, that's it for now and uh, good night. Bye bye. See you next time.